There was something a little different Thursday at the Long County Health Department's COVID vaccine clinic. More people getting a shot, like Rena Copps. One of my friends was exposed, so well, they had it, so it made me exposed. So I was like, let me just go ahead and get this vaccine. The gift cards worth $100 also helped. I think a lot of it is is hesitancy and a little fear of, of getting the vaccine uh, from what they've heard from other people or what they've seen online. Some of them said that, you know, having the incentive kind of helped them to kind of go over the hump and persuaded them to do it. Angela Hartley from the Coastal Health District says the incentive of gift cards is just something they felt they had to try. That's because the vaccination rate here is just 19%. Health officials say the low vaccination rate here just allows the virus to keep circulating and circulating in the community and that the 19% they have now is a far cry from where they need to be. That's a long way from developing herd immunity and herd immunity would would cause this to, to stop circulating. So the shots were given and the gift cards distributed. Long County Sheriff Craig Nobles even stopped by saying people should ask their doctors for advice, not social media. And I've been to a lot of funerals uh, in the past months and uh, I haven't been to a funeral, funeral yet that's been a vaccinated person. For Hartley, it's about saving lives. What has really hit us with the Delta wave is we've seen younger people um, getting COVID and, and having really bad outcomes and having some deaths. And that's what we want to try to prevent. 30 and 40 year olds dying of COVID, we shouldn't have that happening. And, and it's very heartbreaking that that's happening. Joanne Merrigan, WSAV News 3, on your side.